welcome to our youtube channel today we are going to learn class 11 commerce subject statistics chapter number 9 geometric progression last time we have completed in exercise 9 section a today we are going to start section b give answer in one sentence for the following questions so first question is what is the end term okay we have to find end term of the GD AR, AR square, AR cube up to so on so first we have to record what is the formula for finding end term in GD okay if first term is A and common derivative is R then end term of a GD is given by A into R raised to N minus 1 it gives end term of N GD okay where A is the first term and R is the Common so in given GP, first we have to find out first term and common ratio. Then put the value of first term and common ratio in this formula. Okay. So here first term is equal to AR. Okay. Common ratio. is equal to T2 upon T1 ok common ratio is given by TN upon TN minus 1 ok we have to take any term ok we have to take any term divide by its previous term is it there so it is given by T2 upon T1 that is AR square upon AR ok AR square upon AR so AA cancel out AR R square upon R gives R now Use this formula. We know that TA equal to A into R raised to N minus 1. Here first term is A. Okay. Uh, we have to use uh, different notation because A and R is repeat. So we have to use A1 R1. Okay. A1 R1. So A1 is AR. Okay. A1 is AR. And R1 means common ratio is R. Okay. Rest to N minus 1. Because we have to find out N term. So we have to put N equal to N. So now see. A into. Now see. R is to power 1. R is to power N minus 1. So we have to put N. R is to N minus 1 plus 1. Yes or no? Here base is same. But power is different. Then we have to put N. So R is to N minus 1 plus 1. Will be N. So R is to so end term of the given GP is A into R raised to N. Now see, second number. Find the common ratio of the GP 0 0.1, 0 0.01, 0 0.001, up to so on. Okay. So how to find common ratio? Simple. We have to use this formula. T2 upon T1. Second term upon first term. Okay. So we know that common ratio is denoted by R, so we have to use R. R equal to second term upon first term, T2 upon T1. So here first term is 0 0.1, second term is 0 0.01, third term is 0 0.001, fourth term is 0 0.3 times 0.1, up to so on. So T2 upon T1, so second term is 0 0.01 upon 0 0.1. Okay, so here we have to remove decimal point so it gives 1 by 100 yes or no into same as here 1 by 10 so 0 0 is out so answer 1 by 10 so we get that 0 0.1 yes third one find the sum of 20 terms ok we have to find the sum of 20 terms of the GP GP is 7, 7, 7 up to so on. Okay. Uh, so we have to find some. Okay. So we have to use the formula of SA. Okay. So here first of all we have to check the value of R is equal to 1 or R not equal to 1. Okay. So here R is equal to P2 upon P1. So 7 upon 7. It gives 
So here the value of R is equal to one. Okay. So S N is equal to n into a. Okay. So S twenty is equal to n. N means we have to find sum of twenty terms. It means the value of n is twenty. So twenty into a. A is first term. Here all terms are seven. Okay. So first term will be seven. So twenty into seven. So answer is seven two zero. Two. 